What's up guys, today I'm going to show you how to make the Mr. Beast style subtitles in your videos. First you want to head over to the link in the description. Here we can download the font. When we've downloaded the font, we can select this zip and click extract all. Choose your location and click extract. In the new location, click on the true type font file, click on it and select install. After you've installed this font, please make sure to restart Premiere Pro. Once we're inside Premiere Pro, we're going to hit T on our keyboard and click in the middle of our frame. We'll see this red box up here. We're going to type a, a short text to configure our settings. As you can see, I already configured mine, but I'm going to show you how to do it. First, you want to head over to your font and select Kamika Axis right here. Then you want to head over to Fill and enable it. It's probably enabled by default. Then you want to head over to stroke, enable it, put the color on black and put the thickness on 13 right here. Then you want to enable the shadow. Also put that on fully black. You want to increase the percentage to 100% right here. You want to decrease these percentages to zero and this one to 7.6. Once you've done that, your text should probably look like this. Now we have our text in the middle but it's not really a subtitle. We're gonna head over to Essential Graphics and we're gonna align it using the Align Horizontally button. And we're also gonna use this these positionings to pull the text down and scale it a bit. So we're gonna align it again, bring it down. Now, so now you have a single text, which is right here. But if you wanna animate subtitles, for example, you wanna uh, put some text behind this, what you can do is you can duplicate this layer using Alt, Drag, for example, three times if you want to say three words. So right now, the first one says PPFT. Right here, I'm going to add, just click on it to add. We're going to click add is. And for the third one, we're going to add is cool. Now make sure to in select these individual files and to uh, align them in the middle so it, the animation is smooth. So we're going to do the same thing over here. Align it in the middle. And uh, now we're gonna zoom in a bit and use drag to drag these layers really close to each other. So now, as you can see, maybe they need to be dragged a little bit closer to get each other. Now you have this quick animation and you can vary these speeds uh, based on what the, how fast the person is saying words. So the beginning of, the, uh, of this clip right here, this text, should be in, at the beginning of when the person starts saying the word. And so you can just repeat this process and from now on it's a lot easier because you can just use all drag to duplicate the text and adapt it uh, according to what the person's saying. So hopefully uh, you enjoyed this. Thank you.